everyone again i'm here it's me renny from renny's world so after a long time i'm making this video because um lots of things i was going through i just moved my house to melbourne from sydney and um for this covid i was so busy i was a bit sick for the flu not covid just for the flu the weather and all and also today i am 36 week and five days pregnant yeah it's it's a big news i know so just because i'm almost to um there just to the delivery because um it's almost 40 weeks that's why i'm just um here to make some videos on my hospital bag because i have already packed my hospital bag so i want to show you what's in my hospital bag as my stuff my baby's stuff and uh, am i taking something for my postpartum time because uh, after delivery is a big issue so um let's go okay so this is actually my bag i can show you because i'm sitting on the floor and um you know i'm a bit heavy so i can't stand up and show you right now but i'm gonna show you all the stuffs that i'm carrying with me so at first i'm showing you my stuffs that i'm taking uh for the time to delivery um all right so at first sleepers i'm taking the sleepers to the hospital because um Lots of bloggers, they just um, say that this is necessary and lots of my friends, they actually say that as well, this is necessary. So I am something taking which is comfortable. I love this fluffy things. That's why I'm taking this pair of slippers. All right, this is one thing. The next is a water bottle. This is so necessary because um, uh, you need to drink a lot of water, lots of water, because you're gonna give birth. Cause, and I am uh, planning for vaginal birth, so lots of push and lots of like water you need. So that's why I am taking this so that I can uh, put it aside and anytime I can drink it. All right. And then I'm taking a dress. It's actually long dress. It's a long dress and it has buttons here that um, I can open it easily or if I am if I'm feeling warm <coughs> and um, if I uh, want to feel more comfortable that I can um you know like open the button off so that's why i'm taking this long one that i don't need to put some pants on or anything else this is long enough to cover me up so that's why i'm taking this and also i'm taking this pajama set because i think uh, after delivery i need it i need it this is a um, kind of oversized t-shirt with long sleeve because um, the hospital is so cold and I'm a cold person I catch cold so easily so that's why I'm taking this um, long sleeved t-shirt <laughs> and with a pant this is actually so big for me but now I have a big tummy, so that's why it's gonna fit on me. I think so. I've already uh, trialed it and it's actually fit on me. I'm so fat now. It's okay. I'm giving birth. All right, so this pajama set I needed at night. 
sorry. I just heard a sound. So that's why I'm taking it. At night time, I can put it on. And for the large size t-shirt, I can actually breastfeed if I need. If I can actually, if I can. And then another t-shirt. I'm not actually um, packing over, like I'm not gonna be overpacked. I'm trying to minimize my things that what I actually need, what is too necessary for me, just those things. I'm, I'm trying to pack cause. And then another dress. This dress is for my homecoming. And this is kind of like another uh, comfy dress. I can show you. It has this and this is long maxi dress it's kind of maxi dress that um it has something like this that i can um i can open it anytime i want um through the drive to the hospital and uh, you know like if i need to breastfeed my baby that i can open it up and breastfeed my baby and also this is kind of comfy the material is so good like cotton and all and also like not tight it's um loose and yeah i think it's pretty good for a homecoming for me that's why i just bought it and then uh, i'm taking this set of belt i actually um ordered it from amazon um, I can't remember how much it was I actually can't remember anything about like how much I paid for them I actually bought a lot of things from Amazon so, this belt is for um, after give birth you need to like um, all of your stomach and everything like it's just gonna loosen up so you need to get them back so that's why this belt is gonna help me to get them back. Um, a lot of actually um, ladies make vlog on this belt. So I have my little research on this and I thought like, why not? If um, it's gonna help to tuck your belly again, like the same position, not instantly, it's gonna take some time, but it actually helps so um, i saw some videos that's why i just took it i just bought it let's yeah let's try if it's gonna work i'll let you know of course and they have three pairs one is for upper belly and another one is for the your pelvis area because um, you're gonna give birth and your pelvis is gonna like you know um, how to explain I don't know <laughs> anyways you better understand so your pelvis is gonna like this that's why it's gonna like tuck you again and this is for the lower portion of your pelvis so three together three belts so you have to put um, up one up uh, like upper abs and then another one is lower abs and the middle is pelvis there so three so I'm taking it with me and uh, not instantly maybe after delivery uh, you have to wait for a couple of hours and then you can uh, use it so let's try if I can I will definitely do it <laughs> all right and then I'm gonna take I'm taking a bunch of underwears <laughs> bunch of underwears and also my uh, maternity bra so I need those because I can't wear fancy panties that's the time and also like um i can't wear still i can't wear that um normal bras 
that have wears and all i have to wear something comfortable that is kind of like maternity things and these pendants are kind of large size oh oh i'm taking this band with me in my panty bag okay i didn't know anyways so these are kind of like oversized i'm gonna show you yeah this is too large it's too large so ah, there's a little flower here anyway so this large panties i'm gonna take with me there those are a lot because i don't know how many i need and also my mechanical bra as well and uh, i'm taking some some nipples <laughs> i mean like it's like silicone nipples if they allow me to feed my baby uh with this um silicone nipples from the first time i will definitely do because i don't want to um, breastfeed my baby directly from my skin and this is kind of easy um i saw that and i like that some ladies just use it on their nipples and it's just a stock and then baby just suck it suck from here and the milk just came out from here so this is kind of good and this is soft as well um and also so thin so your baby is not gonna feel it that sh she or he what your baby is uh, gonna like sucking the silicone thing but this is actually kind of cool thing for me uh, so that's why i'm just taking it it's just a pair i bought it just a pair so if my midwife and my nurses just allow me to feed my baby with these nipples i will do it so that's why i'm taking it and the next thing i'm taking okay this body spray that shower fresh if after giving birth i they are not gonna allow me to take shower that i can spray myself like this because i'm not gonna smell like blood and all <laughs> all the time so that's why i'm taking this all right and i am taking this pad these are actually kind of cool thing what i definitely need a lot everybody actually talk about this that i need that a lot uh to soothe myself uh that means like So I bought actually two boxes of them and they are like uh, some pads. They're cooling pads cause uh, um, after delivery, uh, you're gonna feel a lot of heat down there. So you need to uh, soothe it up. You need to be feel relief and cool there cause uh, sometimes it's a burn it's burn a lot you, you'll feel the burning sensation there so that's not actually kind of so pleasant so that's why a lot of lots of mothers just um, recommend this thing these pads I can't open it right now because uh, still I have some time so these are um, kind of circle things pads that is hazel witch made with hazel witch uh yes it's witch hazel 50 person and uses as a temporary relief of itching and burning and yeah warning for external use only of course stop use and ask doctor if erectile bleeding or continued irritation occurs all right and directions are there gently apply to affected areas by patting and then discard so um what actually everyone do they just put two pads on um the maternity pad uh, i'm gonna show you my maternity pad those are so huge so um, i'm actually taking the panties 
uh, maternity paint is with pads and um, maybe my hospital is gonna um, give me some pads so that's why I'm gonna use those uh, and I'm not taking anything any kind of pads at all so I'll put them on that and then I will wear that panty so this is for that instant relief after delivery so this is so worth it i'll let you know after using this so after delivery um when i'll make another video about my must-haves for newborn baby what i bought already but let's see what i'm gonna use for my baby so that time i will let you know how it works all right and then i'm taking a pair of socks a pair of socks these are kind of like thick material but light wear my husband like bought it for me because my feet are always cold so he thought that i need it maybe i need it so that's why he just bought this for me so okay <laughs> and then i'm taking this oh okay this pouch i have something in this pouch like a moisturizer cream and then body lotion and uh, okay boro plus hand yeah, it's hand cream. It's um, from Body Shop, a hand cream. And this is my actually um, face um, care thing that is capsules of serum thing. This one is serum and another one is oil. So I'm taking this serum one because it is kind of uh, sticky. So it, it's going to like stay on my skin. And I have this because I need it. I must need it and chapsticks i need it very badly because i'm i'm so cold and dry person so i need it must be and always i have one i have one in my bag because i'm a dry person and also some other serums like night repair cream and serums okay so couple of them that i don't know how many knives i'm gonna stay in the hospital so i'm just taking it and also i have pest i have brush in there and i'm not taking any shampoo and all now everything is done oh i'm gonna show you the maternity pads that is actually like panties i'm just taking this this is a um, 60% more absorbent overnight protection. So this is extra large because I don't want something stuck in there like after delivery. I want something of course like a bit loose but comfy and stick and stay all night. So that's why and it's, it's like this. It has a pad inside it has a pad inside here and this is kind of painty uh yeah this is kind of painty and with a pad so i am i can use it once and then throw it in the bin <sighs> short of breath okay so this is done my things are done and now what I'm taking for my baby doll. So, at first, <sighs> just give me a second. All right. I'm taking this box for her. And I'm gonna show you what's more. I have lots of swaddles lots of swaddles with me because i don't know um how many nights i'm gonna stay there and how many swaddles 
uh, my midwife and nurse is gonna use and I just know that a uh, baby like to be swaddled for the first couple of days uh, all the time so that's why I'm taking a couple of swaddles all right and then what's in the box I have a couple of dresses yes uh, these all are actually kind of onesies for her and I don't know um, how big my baby is but she must be big because she I'm um, 36 weeks and five days pregnant and still I have some time but she's already three pound sorry three kg not pound three kg so I think she's gonna be a bit big so that's why all kind of sizes I'm taking you can see so this is the smallest size I have the smallest size this is kind of bluish and then this one a cute one just done nine months inside so this is a bit bigger than this you can see so I'm taking all kind of sizes for her and this is another one daddy's little princess or a legend that is little regent so that one is the same size of the before and this one is so cute mickey mouse this is kind of looks like a boyish but i like the print this is disney print and i like mickey mouse so that's why i'm taking it because this is a bit uh, wide as well you can see this is a bit wide as well so um if she's big then she can fit in that one as well um i don't know and this one is the full size this is cute it's the bird thing and onesie so this is the biggest one the largest one so yeah zero to three months triple zero size so these are all onesies i'm taking with me because um i don't know what size she's gonna be <laughs> sorry so these are onesies i'm taking onesies a lot of onesies and then another onesie <laughs> but this is cute this is a dress actually this is actually a dress but there is a button here that yeah there's a button here that i can actually change the diaper anytime i want and it's kind of easy um it's not zipper it's just kind of like buttons um you can hear that yeah so So this is cute so let's see um, if she's gonna like it or not she should like it this is so cute okay so one gone and this is gonna be her maybe homecoming one so I'm taking two of them this one is for homecoming or this one is for homecoming let's see because this one have no buttons they just open so I'm take just um I'll put a diaper on and with some with a diaper pants that I already bought for her and then with with this one I'll put it on and other one is this one so let's see which one she likes or which one is gonna fit on her another swaddle and yeah it's actually swaddle with uh, bobbies because um, I don't know she needs some bobbies as well or not but um, I'm taking them it's like cool thing and it's so easy 
and then just stick it so it's easy to put on so um, i'm taking these bobbies as well if um, she need if she need i don't know so i'm taking just three of them not much just three so if i need more that i can ask my husband to bring some more from house because she got a lot of those as well <laughs> so uh, my husband can bring them as well so i'm not gonna overpack i'm just taking three of them and another one another one that i like this a lot there's two of these it's just i have to tuck her in here where is that oh <laughs> so i have to tuck her in here and then i've just wrap and it's just swaddle a cute little swaddle so it's from i can't remember the name whatever maybe mama's way i just bought it from mama's way so that is cute one as well and easy to put on your baby your newborn baby and another thing i bought from the mama's way that is the coolest thing i think i bought this one yeah what is this one mama's way yeah i'm right so this is actually This is a wrap. Yeah, this is a wrap. So I can actually hold my baby with it. I can hold my baby with it. And I can cover her with it. It's something like this. I can cover it. I can cover and just you know this is it I can cover it you can see and then I have to just they actually showed us how it works so I'm just trying to be like that yeah it's a strong enough not gonna open and then I'm gonna put my baby here and then I can breastfeed her I can carry her anywhere so yeah so this is the coolest thing I think <laughs> um, in all of them so and also it's so big so big you can use it as you want like you can cover like this and then breastfeed your baby however you want you can do it but this is actually so cool one and it's like then you can just fold it up and then there is a pocket here you can just pop it in yeah so it's easy so easy um then you just pop it in and it's just yeah back to the bag <laughs> i didn't do the, it perfectly but you can do it because i'm in a rush then i'm taking this one this one i'm gonna put my baby's photo here and also it has something on the back that i can actually take my baby's hand and um footprint and stick it here and also the name and everything like welcome to the world so i'm taking this with me and also a camera because I needed to take the photo, the first photo. So that's why I'm taking this camera with this one. 
separately, totally separate, not in the bag. I'm just taking it like this huge bag. And also another lots of things here. These are pacifier. These are pacifier zero to three months. So <clears throat> I'm taking two of them for the pacifier that I can give it to them. All right, so that's why I'm taking this pacifier, two of them. I have lots of diapers with me. It's in the bag, like this side, it's full with the diapers. And um, it's Rascal Friends, <laughs> the brand. Okay, so lots of um, diapers I'm taking because I don't know if they're going to include the diapers or not. Um, so it's actually better to be prepared. So that's why I'm taking this lots of diapers with me. And also this, water wipes. And this water wipe has lots of reviews that is, those are good. It's 99.9% .9 water. I don't want anything like alcoholic based or like alcohol based wipes to wipe my baby's bum. So that's why I'm taking this water wipes. I thought like this is the perfect one for the baby. Baby, like newborn baby's bum. Another bunch of hair ties because yeah of course i need those and yeah paste another paste anything else should be a charger in there oh i'm taking actually a charger and some snacks as well with me but those are actually in different bag i forgot to Sorry, I forgot to bring them with me so, here. Yeah. So this is all I've got for my bag, for my delivery bag. And I hope like my baby is gonna come so early. Cause this is my, I'm 35 week and five days now. And after 36 week, um, cause my baby is a bit big, so maybe it's not gonna take so long. So just pray for my baby and me that we both are can be healthy. And I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. Thank you so much. Um, if you think I need something more or I should take something more with me, then please comment on the comment below and let me know that what else I'm forgetting to take with me. And thanks for watching. I hope you're gonna be with me for my next journey. Thanks a lot. Bye! And don't forget to subscribe and like, please.